Okay, so this screen recording is um, basically going to show you how to work with Oracle Web Center Spaces. Um, it takes your single sign-on username and password, I believe. Let's see. Log in. It's got a register thing here, so I don't know what the point of that is, but um, so we're chugging along here. Um, okay, so whoa, some serious thunder outside. I live in Hong Kong, where we get these. I'm finding out these crazy typhoons and weather patterns. I've turned off screen recording because nobody really wants to see my ugly face. Oh, it's not that bad, Fenton. But um, <clears throat> otherwise, I would show you what it looks like outside. But there's some serious cloud going on. Um, so you get some running commentary while we're waiting for this powerhouse snappy interface to load. <clears throat> Insert sarcasm there. Um, but this is an internal system that I think is, I don't know if it's run by global IT, um, may or may not be, um, but it seems to be, I, I'm 100% certain that it's, that the product management team has their hands on it. Um, so let's look at these group spaces. Um, Let's just create one. Um, if we want to create a different one down the track uh, for the APAC strategy team, no big deal. Um, but this is just sort of showing you how to do a few things. So, group space templates, they have templates, lovely. Um, which one do we want? I couldn't imagine which one we want. Community of interest with wiki and blogs group project with wiki and blogs. Let's do community of interest. And the group space name, let's call it APAC Tech Strategy. And um, four team headed by Shuchim Trahan uh, I guess that's probably enough. We don't want to get too over the top. We hit create. And we wait for this power horse snappy machine to do its thing. Um, if you wanted to increase the speed of this sucker, I think um, some of the things that you could maybe perhaps do. I don't know if this is backed by rack um, or not. Yeah, that's something that we can find out from the product management team, what the architecture of this thing is. But this stuff deploys to the WebLogic server, so you could maybe stick in coherence. It, you know, sits on top of Oracle databases. So this is asking about members. So let's see if I can find Darren Davis, because this should be his baby, hopefully. Um, so search. Whoa, that's some massive thunder. Darren Davis. Let's see if I've got his spelling right. Yeah, that's right. And let's so enter a search term to find usernames and email addresses. See what that does. Okay, cool. We found them. Don't think there's more than one. Enterprise architecture domain lead. Looks good. And add users, and we'll say, and we want to give them the role of moderator. I guess that's probably the highest, most powerful thing. That's what I am, so that's good. And why don't we just add a couple other people while we're at it? Um, Shuchim and Anton, and maybe Keith. Uh, so Shuchim, Trahan, search. Good enough. And I have, but I have to keep this video relatively short because only they'll only accept moderator ad members. Blah blah blah. So I'll leave it at that. And let's hit. So I don't know what else we want to do. There's a whole bunch of other crap that we can do here, but uh, I think that's done for that. So if we 
So now we can just go to the space. Um, and it takes us, let's go to the home page. And here we can do all the bloody things that we want to do. Like Shuchim can keep his list of action items here for us instead of in his own personal spreadsheet, perhaps. Okay, so let me finish the screencast there. Um, and I'll put up another one with how to do the web dev connection to the content server underneath because that's pretty cool. Okay.